What's good, YouTube? Man, it's your boy, your own dub, coming at y'all with another video here. Uh, I know all of you base head people, you base head junkies, just came here to see this stuff. No, I know I'm totally full of crap. I know y'all are here because of what's on the title of this video. Uh, but since I'm on the verge of installation, might want to check out some photos. Check out that Instagram that will be linked in the description box of this video here. But uh, since I am on the verge of uh, installation, man, I did have to get some plastic panel tools. Uh, I need to get some door clips and stuff like that, man. And anytime you got to do installing, at least for me, I got to have that good old test of tape, man. So got some more of that in, ordered via eBay, came via Amazon, whatever. But uh, let's get to the real reason that we did this video here. So uh, if y'all have been around and following my build, uh, y'all know as far as mid base this year, we're going with the PRV 6MB 550FT. <clears throat> FT. Those are the, uh, the Forte speakers. Um, two inch voice coil, 275 watts RMS, uh, 550 watts program power. Uh, shout out to my man PRV Tim. Um, he's telling me to go with something along the program power. Uh, so that's just what I did. So let's go ahead and get this open, man. Like I said, I'm pretty sure y'all are here due to the title of the video. Uh, might be subscribed, might be somebody passing through. So let's just get to it. And uh, you know how PRV does it, man. You spend a certain amount, they send you some stuff. I've got this, I think, three times over now. Keychain, wristband, PRV banner. Got, let's see. I think I got, I think I got two black ones and two orange now, but whatever, man. <laughs> That's the reason for this video. Let's get this open. Get this damn she's heavy. Okay. That right there is the reason for this video. That right there is the PRV SQ3500X. Uh, this is a class D one channel amp. Obviously, hopefully you'll be able to see all of that there. Um, this should be the one ohm version, and y'all will see why. Uh, this is the one on Virgin coming up real soon here, but uh, let's go ahead and pop that top and take a look. <laughs> Got another er, keychain. Actually using the other PRV keychain right now at the moment, so that's what's up to get a new one of these. Got those good old decals. A bigger one, this will be going on the window. And you get this here. I guess it's a kind of a layout as to um, the performance of the amp, what it's capable of. I'll go ahead and put that on the camera so y'all can see it. But let's get back down to the nitty gritty. That's the real reason why this video is up and going. So, uh, <laughs> this is huge for a Brazilian amplifier, man. Give me just a second. So, there she is. Uh, like I said, 3,500 watts RMS. Uh, this is the one ohm version. Y'all, this is a Brazilian amp. This thing is freaking huge. So, you got two uh, dual fans. You're powering your ground hook up here. And on the other side, I know a lot of y'all might be shocked. Uh, let's see if she'll focus better. So you got your negative speaker uh, hookup and then your positive. And all you got is your left and right input. Uh, the one ohm indicator right there. And then your gain. So you might be saying, hey man, where's the crossovers? Where's the this, that, and the third? She don't got it. So basically what's gonna happen if you get this version of the amp, they're basically encouraging you or more or less pushing you to get this here. There is no way in the world that you should buy this amp if you're not buying this or some type of DSP. 
And once again, I'll put that down there. I know I, I didn't say it probably like eight times, but I'm gonna say it again. This amp is freaking huge. This is a Brazilian amp, y'all. Let me get my Q1200. That way we'll do a size comparison. That's the box that the Q1200 comes in. She's bigger than the box. Give me just a second. All right, so there's your Q1200. I mean, granted, that's this thing down here is pretty much triple the power of this amp, but still, man, y'all know Brazil, anytime you go Brazilian, the thing about it is like, oh man, it's, you know, huge power in a small space, but this one is huge power. And, uh, you know, I mean, from all my old school guys that are watching this, 3,500 watts probably used to be the size of this table that I'm doing the unboxing on. Uh, but for the new people, um, I know, I, man, was it two, two years ago, three years ago, I had that Teramps HD 3000 pure trash, but that amp literally was probably the size of this. This thing, 3,500 watts RMS is a, is a tank. She's huge, man. So y'all know what this is, man. <laughs> the 2021 build. We are getting this thing going. We got this 1200 here. We got the 3500 right under that. <sighs> it's time to get rolling, man. I got some stuff in the works, man. Y'all know how to do. I got some stuff laying around I need to do videos on. I've just been super busy. Uh, try to be upbeat for this video. I hope I'm not coming across too fatigued, man, but I am wore the fudge out. Uh, so, definitely wanted to get this video up and going uh obviously for the channel uh we did unbox this together because i just got this in uh wanted to hurry up and get a, um take a look at it myself uh just to see how big this freaking thing is oh man let me see hold on might as well do it for the channel man uh because it's one thing to have that 1200 watt right there but what doesn't matter if you ain't got that sitting around this thing is 10 inches wide and yeah, 10 by 10 maybe 10 and a half um that's just the chassis let's see from the speaker to the one out terminals uh she's about a foot long uh so yeah might want to think about that uh if you're taking a look at this amp maybe considering putting this in your own personal vehicle uh like i said man we know brazilian to be very um conservative as far as the size uh they squeeze the hell of power out of manager amps like this here uh so you might want to take a look at that if you're considering getting this amp and like i said no need to get this amp if you're not getting it, uh this here piece or some type of dsp because uh like i said she doesn't have the crossover base boost we don't use that anyway but your base boost all that type of crap like i said your crossover she just comes with the rcas in the game uh so if you're not going to be able to use this to get your stuff crossed over, man, don't even think about buying this amp here, man. So, y'all know the deal. 2021. We're doing a budget bill. Uh, got some, like I said, man, I got some stuff in the works. Uh, got some stuff coming, man. Uh, stay tuned. Uh, y'all will take, y'all be able to take a look at everything with me, man. So, 2021. God damn it. If your mirrors ain't shaking, damn it, you got taken. And y'all know the thing, man. I will stick around. Word up, bitch. I'm out of 5,000. Peace. <laughs> Peace out, man. Y'all have a good weekend.